All right, guys, welcome back. Uh, this is part two of the how to make your own resin models uh, tutorial. Here, uh, it's already set for about two hours, the, uh, the first half of the mold. Uh, I'm removing the clamps. Uh, right here, you would want to be careful. Uh, you remove the tack, save them like that. We use them for the next part also uh, when you do the other half of the mold. Um, yeah, when you are removing the, the wood panels, be careful. I'm doing it with one hand. You could mess up, like you can see the wood is bending there, and you can mess up your, your wood panels. Use both hands, obviously. Um, and be careful with the mold itself. Um, so yeah, over here I'm going to be taking it off. Let's see what else is going happening in the video. Uh, yeah, the reason I'm doing this re editing because I, I, when I first did these videos, I, I posted it up and uh, I guess I, I, I did it with a model that I shouldn't have been doing it. And uh, so I reshot it, I re edited it. I tried to blur out. I'm working with a Mac iMovie, it's horrible. I've never done this before, so uh, that's why it's crap. But I didn't want to do a whole video again, so I want to move on, you know, with the hobby also. But um, yeah, here I'm removing it, um, the wood planks, uh, and I think I'll show you uh, a little bit of me. Uh, you can see the clay bottom there, taking it apart, and that's how it looks. Uh, it's a quick still picture. The clay, you would remove it. Um, uh, uh, the clay I'm using here is uh, reusable and never dries out. Put it aside, and you can use it for your next mold. Also, I forgot to mention. Um, things uh, I, when I'm doing my molds I'm, I'm, I'm doing it on an old uh, kitchen uh, cutting board just so where when I do it I uh, I can move it around and I have it on, on my workstation uh, here's the the one half uh, just by itself uh, I'm about to put now you repeat the whole project uh, process again you would re put the mold box in again nice and tight and you would just uh, re pour the other half of this uh, silicone that's uh, already ready for the next half uh, and yeah I just pour the next half and wait for it to cure and after that you have your your two-sided mold so once again uh, I, I didn't get to finish because the video is moving pretty fast <laughs> um, yeah the wood uh, the, the cutting board so you can move it around uh, paper towels uh, once you're, uh, you finish using the products there's going to be residue in the cups you could clean it up with paper towels. You should always have paper towels anyway when you're doing this to clean up. And obviously, don't do it like me, the idiot I am, right next to your laptop. But yeah, over here, I'm removing. Um, it's done. The other half is done. I'm removing it. Uh, again, also. And yeah, it's pretty pretty much easy. Once if you if you get a good system with this, uh, uh, with the uh, what is Umu 25 and the Smooth Cast 300? You you have you could be pumping them out. Not that you want to be pumping them out, but you could do a mold and a plastic in maybe three hours, uh, 74 minutes each. Also, I'm showing this because uh, I'm I'm trying to use that also to make some molds. Um, uh, see how that goes. Uh, going back to uh, the. You, uh, each side of the mold would be uh, oh also here I'm showing um, always measure make sure so you don't have wasted product which how I had there uh, the silicone dries in 74 minutes so you'll have 74 minutes on one half 74 on the other one and the rest and dries up like in minutes so hope hope you enjoy the videos and um, please uh, rate comment and subscribe take care man